Welcome to this Windows channel and today we're gonna tell you a little secret that most people don't even know. You can actually have a real working Microsoft Office for free by using the Office Online option. For a lot of people Microsoft Office is not worth buying. I get this all the time. I go to clients, homes, and they need PowerPoint or Word or something temporarily only for a file that somebody send them and you know paying more than a hundred bucks for a office key for most people I think is something uh, not really really necessary and for a lot of people using office 365 subscription is not necessarily a good idea also it all depends on the usage that you have of course if you're an every office user it is better to actually either purchase an office 365 uh, subscription or buy at a computer shop a office key so that you can install the software on your computer but if you're not a very heavy user if you only need for example a word processor because because you want to update your resume or do a letter and it's something that you rarely do well OfficeOnline.com is the place to go or office.live.com live, office slash start slash default. I'll be posting this address on the, uh, the uh, description of the video just below the video if you need to uh, have the address. But you can uh, easily go there by just typing in the address bar of your browser OfficeOnline.com and you'll be greeted to this page. What you need for this to work is an internet connection. That's very important because this is an online version of Office. So you'll need to have a internet connection. And you'll also need to have a Microsoft account. If you have, a, if you have an Hotmail account or Outlook.com account, it's already good. You can use that. If you have a Windows 8 computer or Windows 10 computer, uh, of course, you probably already have a Microsoft account and you can use that. To log in here and well if not why not just create an account it's totally free when you get to the page you get these options word OneNote Excel outlook.com PowerPoint you got the OneDrive you got the calendar and people it's very useful and it's really really works like a real thing so once you've logged into your account all you have to do is just click the um, app that you need so for example, if you want to write a document, you use the Word document, um, Word, Word processor, and your browser will transform itself like a real Word document, a real Word app. You've got your toolbars, you've got everything you need at the top. It has all the options that you'll have in a real Microsoft uh, Word or Microsoft Office. You can save your documents in your OneDrive folder if you want that's one thing that you can do and by default it uses OneDrive but you can also click the Save As button and if you want you can download a copy which means that you'll have a Word copy on your own computer you can even download it as a PDF file which is very very nice you can save it, save it to OneDrive do whatever you want with it it's really really cool if you click open you can open of course from your OneDrive folders but you can also um, open any file from your computer if you want now this is totally free no subscription and you really really have a real Microsoft Office you've got templates uh, if we look at Excel for example let's say uh, we're gonna make a list here and take this template well you'll go into the real Excel like app and have everything you need if you need a spreadsheet you've got everything you need just take a blank document it's fantastic it's free works really well what's nice is by using the OneDrive is that you can actually store on your OneDrive all the documents you make which means they're available on any device that you might want to go to office online which is 
something quite interesting. So totally free, why not take a look? Maybe that's all you need to actually open a Word um, or maybe work some document without even having to purchase anything. OfficeOnline.com If you enjoy our videos, why not subscribe to our channel? You'll be informed when new videos are online. If you have any comments, questions, maybe you have something that you'd like us to make a video or talk about, why not give us suggestions and we'll try to make a video if possible. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.